when we're born as a human being, we have lots, lots of debts. Debts to our parents, debts to the people who provide us with food, clothing, shelter, medicine, all the things we need in order to be here right now. So we have to do something to repay those debts. This is one of the reasons why we develop good qualities in the mind. Because it's through the good qualities of the mind that we can repay those debts. We develop the goodness through generosity, the goodness through virtue, the goodness through meditation. All these are ways of repaying our debts. And they say the, the only person in the world who doesn't have any debts anymore is, in, is the Arahant. No debts to anybody. And in the meantime, we've got our debts. And how do we get ourselves out of those debts? Like we're meditating right now. So always remember that when you're meditating, it's not just you who benefits. You're repaying debts to other people. When you're monk, this is especially clear when you're out going for alms round. There are times in Thailand when people from really, really poor backgrounds, really, really poor little huts that they lived in, they would come out and they put food in my bowl. And I'd remember, okay, today is especially a day you've got to meditate especially well, because you're in debt to a poor, just, poor person's generosity. Well, we're in debt to a lot of people's generosity, not just people. All the animals had to die one way or the other in providing our food. So every time you meditate, and you start getting lazy, you start getting saying, okay, this is enough for today, remind yourself, well, do, give it a little extra to help pay off some of those debts. So you benefit and the people around you benefit as well as you develop good qualities in the mind. At the very least, other people don't have to be such victims of your greed, aversion, and delusion. As, you, as you're creating less and less in your own mind, they receive less and less from you. Ordinarily, the mind is like a factory. It keeps producing these things, manufacturing greed, more greed, more greed, more aversion, more delusion all the time. And so we close down that factory, we open up the factory that's creating more mindfulness, more alertness. This is a choice we have. And as we've seen in the, the factories of the world, some factories create really useful things. Those are factories that, are, that should be encouraged. There are other factories create a lot of junk and pollute the air as well. Those are the factories that should be closed down. So close down your greed factory and aversion factory and delusion factory and start opening up factories of mindfulness, alertness, concentration, discernment, goodwill. These are the things that make the world a better place. <laughs>